Hi, I'm Bruce Thompson, CEO of Liberty Wheel Systems. One of the questions we're frequently asked is, what are the construction details of the hub dock? What's inside? How does it work? What we have in front of you is a fully assembled hub dock minus the wheel, of course. What I'm going to do is take it apart and show you exactly what's inside. Starting with a standard commercially available cluster, I'm going to remove the through axle, separate the cluster from the hub. You'll notice that inside the cluster is a receiver for the hub drive side. On the hub drive side is a stainless steel insert. That insert is used to provide the necessary wear strength for the moving parts. The hub itself is made out of aluminum. Stainless steel is used to provide the strength and wearability over a long period of time and to prevent oxidization between the parts of the assembly. So what's inside the hub? Well, let's take a look. On the non-drive side is an adjustment collar, which allows you to make up minor differences between lug spacings on a standard frame. Removing that collar a standard hub and here is how the system works. The skewer is attached to a through axle on the end of which are a set of threads that mate with the cluster. As the skewer is turned, the taper on the receiver allows the threads to engage and pull the unit together. Two bearings, one on either side, widely separated to give you more control and a wider stance. When assembled, and adjusted, the thread mates with the cluster. You turn it until it's snug, clamp the lever, and you're done.